Hello YouTube, I'm David with the David West Channel. Today I want to show you how to make fire with patience, plastic, and punk wood. Yesterday we had about four hours of rain, so the bottom of these leaves are very wet. So here's the start of our patience. You want to gather up your tinder, just the very top layer of leaves that are dry. And this is going to take some time. All right, we have two different sizes of kindling, pencil lead size, pencil size, the driest leaves we could find. Now let's go find some punk wood, which is definitely gonna be moist. So I'm gonna take and process it up into a powder, stack it up on top of our leaves, solar ignite it, and just keep on aerating it until it dries out and gets hot enough to send it to flames. It's very simple. The hard part is actually mustering up that kind of patience. Let's see what we can get off of that stump. So much of that is just too wet to use. <laughs> that ought to be plenty. Let's try this. The way we're gonna process it up is to try to turn this into as much powder as possible and then the bigger pieces be on the bottom and the powder on top. There's too much moisture in that piece. We'll use it for a base. Wallet for nettle lens. It's made by Easy Glide. You get a three pack of them for $12 on Amazon. Now just take your time with this. Do whatever you have to do to drive the moisture out of that punk wood until it gets hot enough. Sometimes it'll actually go to flames on its own. I'm gonna ignite it down here at the base. There's so much moisture in it, I'm just gonna keep that focal point on there and kind of dry it out and get it started burning good and hot. And I'll probably have to blow on it a lot too. This is the best way to utilize damp punk wood. And it'll eventually get hot enough to where it'll be self drying and many times go to flames on its own. Patience is key though, I hope you can see that. If you ever wanna be a good fire maker, you're gonna need patience 
not only in this technique, but um, in all the fire making techniques. And it just takes time to drive off all that moisture. I'm going to turn this opening towards the wind. <laughs> 